long time ago, I wrote a program to solve the knight's tour where a knight hits every square on the chessboard exactly once. And I had a computer that could do one million things a second. Unheard of speed compared to a human. And the program sat there and sat there, nothing came out. And I went back and then I recalculated it, it was gonna take 10 to the 25th years. <laughs> so what that taught me was a computer by raw speed isn't the total solution. The solution is the creativity that's in a human's mind to come up with better approaches to solving a problem, better algorithms. So the human brain is very important. And at that time, I never felt that technology would ever equal the human brain, although in recent times, I'm kind of finally this year backing off on that idea. Um, you know, in the, in the future, um, we're gonna have computers that do think and they do feel, you know? And already, who do you ask? You used to ask a smart person a question, you use their brain, their creativity. Now you ask somebody whose name starts with G-O. You know, and for some of you it might be God, but for me it's Google. And I get back all these answers more than any human could give. And I just talk like a natural human. I'd like a reservation somewhere at 8 p.m. And I get the reservation through Siri and programs like that. And, um, you know, will a computer ever be able to sit there once we've done our work on the movie? Play it back itself and analyze it the way a human would analyze it. Was there a mistake? Did something cut at the wrong point? Were some of the words that were used at one point in the movie incorrect compared to something that was said later? Will programs be written that actually detect these things and then tell us how to correct our movie? And we'll look, the program will tell us, oh my gosh, you've got to correct this flaw here and here's a flaw there and here's something people are going to detect there. And we'll go and make the movies a little bit better, won't we? And then you have to say, is the machine helping us be creative or it is it the creative element? And you know, what, is it aiding us or is it creating? And all I can say is you'd have to ask Watson for the answer. <laughs> Thank you.